Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me, Ubuntu Help Guy, and in this video I'm going to show you a few things you can do on your Asus Google Nexus 7. But, some of these tips are actually not only for the Asus Google, uh, Asus Google Nexus 7, they are also for uh, Android 4.2 in general. So, yeah, here we go. So, uh, the first tip I want to show you guys is how to disable the keyboard sounds so if you go ahead and open up settings and then go down to uh, language and input where is it it's right there language and input and then uh, it says android keyboard you just press this settings uh, button right here and um, then right here it says sound on key press all you have to do is uncheck that and that's basically the first tip the next thing I want to show you is how to disable apps. So, uh, like me, if you have the Google Nexus 7, it may come with some pre-installed applications that you don't actually want to use. So if you go ahead and open again settings, and then right here it says apps, click that. And then swipe until you see all apps. And uh, right here you just basically just find the application you want to disable, so uh, for example, uh, let's see right here calendar. I want to disable that so I click and hit disable I really obviously don't want to do that, but you just hit disable and that is it So there you have it. That was tip number two So if you want to make your text larger on your Nexus 7 or just your Android device Then again hit settings and scroll down until you see accessibility and uh, Right here it says large text you basically just hit that and uh, that is it. Now you can also do this by hitting settings and then display and then right here it says font size. So you can change to small, normal, large or huge. Let's try huge. There we go. And again I want to use normal so you just set it back to normal. So if you want to install third party apps on your uh, Google Nexus 7 I don't recommend that you do this if you don't know which apps uh, you want to install but uh, anyway if you want to install third-party apps even though I do not recommend it for new Android users you go to settings and then scroll down until you see security you click that and right here it says unknown sources allow installation of apps from sources other than the Play Store just tap that and you'll be able to install third party apps. So if you have the Nexus 7, you probably want to use the front facing camera right there. Um, but there's really no app for that uh, pre-installed on the Nexus 7. So uh, what you want to do is you want to hit the Google Play Store button or you want to open Google Play Store and then hit search and then type in camera camera Launcher and right there it says camera launcher uh, Let's see for Nexus 7 then you just Basically tap the first one and you hit install and accept and that's it. There you have it the front facing camera Woo! Now a lot of the uh, Nexus 7 owners have experienced some lag at least on uh, the uh, Android 4.2.2 update Um at least so I've heard. I haven't experienced this yet. Uh, but I want to show you how to, you can uh, fix that on your Nexus 7. So uh, if you go ahead and open the app called Currents right there. Uh, then um, if you go to Settings right there in the right corner. Settings. And uh, right here it says, let me see. There we go. It says Enable Background Sync. So this means that it will always sync even if you don't use your tablet. So uh, this will also improve battery life. So just disable that, go back, and now you need to reboot your Nexus 7. But that's basically it. That's all I have for today's video. Six awesome uh, Android tips. Here we go. I can six tips. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Girl Scout.